With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Now here the assertion is that NO2 plus CO gives CO2 plus NO, and the rate for this is that K is directly proportional to NO2 square. The reason for this is rate does not depend upon CO because it is involved in the first step. First of all, we will write the reaction that is. Now, experiment shows that this is the second order reaction and the rate of reaction does not depend upon the concentration of CO. Now, the rate for this is Now here, CO is having its power 0 because the rate of reaction does not depend upon the concentration of CO. So, Now, the rate law suggests that the rate determining step, that is the slowest step, should involve two NO2 molecules. And there should be no CO molecule. Keeping this in mind, following two-step mechanism has been suggested. Step 1. This is a slow step reaction. Step 2. Now the net reaction. This is the net reaction. So, step 1 is the slowest and is the rate determining step. Since in the slowest step there are two NO2 molecules, so rate is directly proportional to NO2 square and the order of reaction is 2. Now, the rate of reaction does not depend upon the concentration of CO because CO is consumed as soon as NO3 is formed. Now, what is an intermediate? Suppose if we are taking any reaction and if the major product formed in that reaction is used further in any other reaction, then that product is called as an intermediate. Intermediate. Here, NO3 is an intermediate because it is the major product. Now, moving towards the question. Now, your answer is if assertion is true statement but reason is false. So, your option 3 is your correct answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.